Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, as you can see in the video, I did promise you guys an unboxing and a haul from my Franklin Planner or Franklin Covey order. So all of my stuff that I ordered for 2017 came in and I just wanted to give you guys a quick peek. Um, this is going to be a fairly quick video. Um, well, the first thing I ordered was a storage binder and I use um, Franklin Covey Compact or Filofax Personal Kiki K Medium. So I ordered a storage binder and I love that they come in these great colors and this one it comes with stickers so you can actually label it. I'm actually going to order another one of these. I'm going to take this and use it for my 2016 inserts because right now I just have them stored in a bunch of my other personal size planners that I'm not using and I want to keep them all together so I can go back and reference them. So I'm going to use this one for 2016 and I am going to go and order another one to um, put my extra Franklin Covey inserts in while I'm not using them and then after I use them to be able to put them um, into the binder for storage and I really like these and I definitely see myself with the Franklin Covey system um, from here on out pretty much so the, I think these are really pretty these are going to look really good on my bookshelf um, and just keep all of my old pages organized so the next thing that I will show you guys um, I'm not sorry about my arm I'm not going to get into this right now I didn't even open it because I didn't want to start digging through it I'm going to do a separate video these are the seven habits of highly effective people inserts this is the two pages per day this is the only way that it comes and um, this comes with a lot of stuff as you can see and um, if you watch any of my previous videos you know that this is these are the inserts that I chose to use for next year I'm um, currently um, in addition to the 10 natural laws that um, hopefully you've seen my series that I'm doing on that. I'm also reading The Seven Habits of Highly Effective People by Stephen Covey. Um, and this comes with a lot of, like I said, additional stuff for that system. So I am going to be doing a separate video right after I finish this one just on these inserts. Um, the Sassy Pineapple did a really, really good flip through. She was the one that actually, um, she didn't convince me to order them. I already knew I wanted them, but she let me see every single page that was in here so I will do a very similar flip through and um, just kind of give you guys some ideas about how I plan on using these for 2017 um, so I'm not going to say much more about these I'm going to set these to the side the other thing I ordered were I have my order sheet here so I can reference the name these are called the hmm, the just page finder multi um, color pack now the clear pouch page finder that is uh, standard with the Franklin Covey system I have one of those they come in the starter packs and there is a starter pack that comes with this so there's a clear one in here that I will be using um, you can actually see it sticking up right there that I'll be using to mark my day and to hold something else I'll show you but I liked these because these allow me to um, it's five different colors and I can mark like my monthly pages with one I can mark I like to mark um let's see if I have a planner here's my planner I'd like to mark where my this is just my notes section in the back so this is where my next blank note page is and then this is my social media section right now and um I keep a running list of YouTube ideas so this is where um, the end of because I have multiple pages of YouTube ideas so this is where the end of that list is so when an idea pops into my head I can just jump right to it and um, you know add a new idea and then same thing up here I have um, school and social media and things like that so I can use these pretty much as those type of tabs instead of um, using the post-it tabs if I don't want to I'm sorry about the lighting let me see if I can add some light in here it just went really dark outside sorry about that I was trying to use natural lighting but it just went really dark outside it's really windy and looks like it's about to storm so that's why I got these and um, what I plan on using them for the next thing I got was just some lined pages and these ones are the I thought it said it on here yeah these are the real life so there is a set of inserts called real life they do have line pages to match the seven habits but the reason I didn't get them is because as you can see these are just very clean 
and plain. I like that divided section over there in case I want to number my notes or just um, add something in the margins. But the seven habits pages, they have like a band of color around the sides and it just eats into the margins. And I tend to, when I'm writing notes or drawing out diagrams, I tend to write in the margins too. So these were just like the cleanest looking that they had, but they weren't like um, super plain like the original notes pages. Again, I like to have that little divided section there. So this is just a pack of 50 note pages um, because I am a little OCD about wanting all of my pages to be the same size. I do still have um, Kiki K note pages and of course my target dollar spot list. But these are for, these are going to be like the lists that are going to stay in my planner long term and the notes that are going to stay in there long term. So um, my cleaning schedule and my routines and extra pages for my goals, things that are going to stay in there. These are not just for just scratch notes or anything like that. That's what I'll use my Kiki K and um, paper and target list pads for. So I wanted to make sure these were the same size as my other inserts because they would be staying in. The other thing I got was the 2017 yearly fold-out calendar for, of course, January through December. And I really love this calendar. It is double-sided. So on this one side, you can see it has the months going straight, or the months going down the side and the days of the week going across. Um, and I'm going to use this to track my fiance's, um, his term breaks that he has in school, um, my son's school breaks. Uh, my school is continuous, so I don't have breaks, but um, and then tracking different like work schedules and vacations and stuff like that. We're already planning our family vacation for next year. Um, of course, baby boy is due. Um, we have a date now, January 13th. Um, my due date is January 20th, but they scheduled my C-section for the 13th. So just being able to track stuff like that and seeing... Um, we hope our son is going to be running track next year, so to be able to see the schedule for the season and let that helps us with determining when we can travel and things like that. And then this is the other side, which I really love this side too. This one is a vertical month, so you have one spot for each day, and you guys know I love the vertical months. Um, that's what I pre-planned with. So I'm not sure what I'm going to use this side for. I considered using it as like an editorial calendar for my YouTube just so I could have one in my planner um, but not have to have a whole set of extra inserts. But I may change my mind about that. So I'm not sure what I'm going to use this side for. But again, this side is going to be, you know, tracking the schedules and the school breaks and holidays and vacations and all that. And... The next thing I ordered were these progressive task lists and um, the seven habit system, they come with the weekly compass cards. And again, I'll talk more about that when I get into that, um, this insert pack, but the progressive task list, basically this is what they look like and they are divided, it's front and back. So they're divided into three different grayed out sections on the front. It's the exact same thing on the back. And what I like about this is this is very similar to how the seven habits pages are set up. You still have your icons for prioritizing your tasks. Um, I ordered two of these, two packs, because it, this is 13 sheets. So once you separate them, you have 26 total. And technically what I was gonna use this for is as my weekly task list, like a running weekly task list so I could still have one because again I don't like writing tasks and assigning them to days if they don't absolutely need to be done that day I like to have a running weekly task list um, so I ordered two so I could have one for each week of the month um, and that's probably how I'm still going to use it um, as far as the grayed out sections what I'm planning on doing is I do want to implement I do like the David Allen's GTD getting things done method I don't agree with some of the aspects of it but I do agree with some of them and I will be doing a video about how I'm combining the seven habits Franklin Covey um, Franklin planner and GTD all in one planner I will be doing a video about that closer to the new year once I get all the pages set up but um, I will be using these as like next actions. So what's going to happen is I may have these for more than a year because these may not switch out every week if I don't get everything done. Because what will happen is it will allow me to not have to rewrite my, my to-do list, my weekly task list. I can just move this from week to week 
until I get the things done or I can keep adding to it. So again, these six sections are going to be like my contacts. Um, so it's going to, I haven't decided which contacts I'm going to use. And I know the contacts may change just depending on what tasks I have to do. But that's how I plan on using this. So it's it's technically technically going to be like a running uh, weekly task list, but it's going to be more like a next actions list. So it may go from week to week. It may not only be for one week. And the last thing I ordered was something fun. These are the Franklin Covey coloring pages. And as you can see, they are already punched for your planner. This is, again, compact size. It comes with 32 sheets in here. And I'm sorry, I maybe I should have gone through with the prices for everything. Um, I'll talk again, talk more about this later. But this was um, $43.95, which I know sounds a little pricey, but when you see what's all in it, it's worth it because um, it includes the starter pack and a whole bunch of other stuff. So that's that. The um, page finder multicolor packs for a set of five was $5.95. The progressive progressive task list, these were $4.95 each. And again, you get a total of 26 task lists, so 13 double pages. So $4.95 each. The 2017 yearly fold-out calendar, um, this was only $2.95 or $2.75, excuse me. And it was so worth it to me. I always tell you guys that I don't use these sometimes because I have my forward planning calendars. But again, like I said, having the extra schedules that we need to manage now and um, wanting to travel more, this is going to be so worth it. And for $275, um, it was worth it to me to have it on Franklin Covey paper, to have it the quality, the rounded edges, instead of me having to like, I could print out one for free on Filofaxi or something. But for $275, this was very much worth it to me. Um, the note sheets were... $5.95, $5.95, and this is for a pack of 50, um, so I'm assuming this is not 50 pages, so this is 25 pages, so double-sided it's 50, um, so 25 sheets, but 50 pages once you get double-sided, so none of those were too bad. These, though, these were $7.95, there's 32 of them, and I will go through and flip through them very quickly. What I love about these, again, they are already punched for your planner. They do come in compact and classic size because when I posted, um, I had posted like a copy of my order um, in the Franklin Covey groups and a lot of people didn't even realize that they had these pages already punched um, for your planner, not for compact size anyway because classic size tends to get a lot of things that compact and other sizes don't. What I love about these is they are blank on the back. So... I like to color with coloring pencils, but if you want to use markers or pens that may bleed through a little bit, because these papers, they're, they're kind of thick, but they're definitely not as thick as some of the Franklin Covey inserts, you don't have to worry about bleeding through on another picture. So I'm just going to flip through very quickly and show you um, what the images look like. Again, this is 32 pages for $7.95, and so it is so worth it. But these are... I love this lion and I love the white space on it and my plan is to just keep them in my planner um, so when I'm waiting somewhere I can you know I have my pencil pouch with me I love this one today is going to be awesome um, but I can just kind of work on them just kind of as a stress reliever just to pass some time because I always have my planner with me because it is also my wallet and um, once I get done coloring them I'm thinking I may take them to like Staples or something. I don't have my own laminator. I know I need to get one, but I'm thinking I'm going to get them laminated and then maybe use these as dividers um, if I ever decide I need new dividers or anything like that. See, so some of them are, are kind of basic, but some of them are very, very detailed. And I just absolutely, I love this elephant. I, I love animals. So all of the animal print ones I absolutely love. This crazy house. I think this would make a really good... Um, Halloween dashboard or divider. I know Halloween is just passed, but for next year, it'd make a really good dashboard. It just kind of looks a little spooky to me. But um, these are some of the other sheets. So like I said, some are kind of simple. Some are really detailed. Love these flamingos. My fiance is from Miami, so flamingos, dolphins, things like that. But they're just really, really pretty. 
and I just I love them I love them I'm just like I'm going to a fully fully functional system for next year but I still wanted to have just a little bit of fun and pretty in there so just tossing in little things like this um, some journaling cards that I got with my I love this one right here those antlers are gorgeous so I can't wait to work on this one um, but just tossing in some just little fun but motivational stuff this is my absolute favorite um, owls are one of my favorite animals um, owls and frogs I don't know why and my school mascot is an owl as well so I really love this one this one might actually be the dashboard for my planner because if you see my planner set up, I do have my pregnancy dashboards, but of course, once I have my baby, um, I'm probably not going to want to look at them anymore. So um, I think this one might be my dashboard at the front of my planner. And that is it. And then it comes with a cardboard backing. And every almost everything that I have comes with one of these cardboard backings. And I know people normally throw them away. I think I'm going to keep these. And these are pretty thick, so these can even be used as dividers and you can draw on them or color on them or collage on them. I know I'm planning on doing um, like some mini vision boards um, or at least one mini vision board for my planner. And this is really thick quality. So this might be what I keep and use these. I have now a couple of them because like I said, each set of inserts um, or each thing I ordered has one at the back of it. So that is it for my Franklin Covey haul um again i will be doing a more detailed video on this as soon as i get done recording this video and then some people have also asked me to um show how these franklin covey compact pages fit in my vanderspec because this is vanderspec personal i mean excuse me vanderspec standard is equivalent to filofax personal but this touch me is widened so it will accommodate compact size pages like if you look at these dividers right here these are the recollections dividers which are just a tad bit shorter than Franklin Covey pages and you can see you know all the space I still have left so these will fit really well so I'll be doing another video on these just to show you what comes in the pack and then I will just be taking all of my stuff out of here and just doing a mock setup just so I can show people how they fit in there so thank you guys for watching. If you have any questions about anything, definitely leave them down in the comment section below and I will see you in my next video.